Hello everyone, pro drum tech drummer and YouTube educator coming to you live from the 2019 Elvis Castello Blondie Summer Tour to talk to you about tuning your drums for your in-ears. All right, now in these environments, sometimes I got different you know, parameters to deal with. So when I tech, I tech with my UE18s. When I drum, I use my 11s. It has that extra bass in there, but the 18s is the six drivers on each side. Doesn't have the extra sub because I don't need extra bottom. I want to hear everything that's going on in case anything changes in my mix world. So I apply the same concept to when it comes to tuning for people's in-ears. Now we have multiple singers on in-ears, which means their mics are open and rich so they can sing comfortably. Subsequently, we want to tame down the drums and shape them for the mix, especially in a room with a tin roof like this. This is a perfect example because for me, normally on an outdoor gig, especially with single ply coated heads like these uh, coated ambassadors and a clear diplomat on the bottom, I mean, it's a classic rock combination, but outdoors you might want more attack. So I've got to maximize attack with what's going on here without bringing the roof into effect. So normally I do perfect fours, but in the in ears, it creates too much air and too much effect. I want a cleaner. Floor tom sound, something that blends in so the front of house can mix with it, the in-ear monitor can mix with it, and it doesn't have a lot of air, which is why I have the weest bits of moon gel. Now these are tuned to a perfect third, or sorry, a major third, and a major third, and a perfect fifth apart, so you get nice separation between the two voices in playing, and you also have a nice little bit higher tuning. These are tuned a little bit higher than I would normally tune them because I want them to project over the mix and sit without being omnipresent and having too much noise, so you get a nice... Everything speaks clearly, allows the front of house to have great toms to mix with, but also allows the in-house engineer to, for your in-ear monitors to really get a nice, clean mix for the vocalist so the drums are present without being omnipresent. Stick around for more quick tips from the road. Check out videos on my YouTube channel, YouTube Kenny Sherrits. This love is like a prison cell, lonely and cold as hell.